Dear viewers, greetings. In this present video, we are going to see about flagella staining. The aim of the flagella staining is to visualize the presence and arrangement of flagella for the identification of motile bacterial species by wet mode method or Rio method. According to the principle, uh, flagella are uh, too thin to be visualized using a bright field microscope with an order stain such as uh, gram stain or a simple stain. Uh, a wet mount technique for staining bacterial flagella is a simple technique and it is uh, useful when the numbers and arrangement of flagella are critical in identifying species of the motile bacteria. A wet mount technique is used for staining bacterial flagella and it is uh, simple and useful when the number and arrangement of flagella are critical to the identification of species of motile bacteria. The staining procedure requires the use of uh, modern that is uh, uh, tannic acid and aluminium potassium sulfate uh, so that the stains adheres in the layers to the flagella and allowing the visualization. Next, the materials required for the flagella staining are 24 horse culture of bacteria, Bunsen burner, microscopic slide, cover slip, Rio strain and microscope. The next to the preparation of the Rio uh, flagella strain which is used for the flagella staining method. The Rio strain has uh, two components. One is uh, solution one. The second one is solution two. Uh, the, the solution one is the moderant and it contains uh, 10 ml of 5 percentage aqueous solution of phenol, 2 gram of tannic acid and 10 ml of saturated aqueous solution of aluminum phosphate sulfate 12 hydrate. And the solution 2 is the strain and it is a saturated ethanolic solution of crystal violet and it is prepared by 12 gram of crystal violet in 100 ml of 95 percentage ethanol. The final strain was prepared by mixing one part of solution 2 with 10 parts of solution 1 and then uh, filtering the mixer through the filter paper to remove the coarse precipitate. Next is uh, procedure. Uh, first, grow the bacteria to be strained at room temperature on blood agar for 16 to 24 hours. And then, add a small drop of water to the microscopic slide and dip a sterile inoculating loop into the sterile water and touch the loop full of water to the colony margin briefly. And this allows the motile cells to swim into the droplet of the water. After that, uh, touch the loop full of motile cells to the drop of water on the slide and uh, cover the fainty tubby drop of water on the slide with a cover slip. A proper wet mount has uh, barely enough liquid to fill the space under a cover slip and small air space around the edge are uh, preferable. And then examine the slide immediately under 40 h for the motile cells. If motile cells are seen, and leave the slide at room temperature for 5 to 10 minutes. And after that, apply two drops of Rio flagella strain gently on the edge of the cover slip. Uh, the strain will flow by capillary action and mix with the clear suspension. And after 5 to 10 minutes at room temperature, examine the cells for flagella. And finally, the cells with flagella may observe at 10 nits oil emission in the a zone of optimum strain concentration about halfway from the edge of the cover slip to the center of the mount. The focusing the microscope on the cells attached to the cover slip rather than on the cells attached to the slide facilitates, uh, facilitates the visualization of the flagella. And the precipitate from the strain is primarily on the slide rather than the cover slip. Observation and results. Uh, observe the slide and note the following things, uh, particularly the three things. First one is the presence or absence of flagella. Second one is number of flagella per cell. And third one is location of the flagella per cell. And that's all about the flagella staining. Uh, dear viewers, thank you for your support. Thank you.